Hey guys, Jennifer Morgan here from Newcastle, California, and I'm, I'm cutting this video today after I spoke to a friend on the phone, and it was a business partner, and they were kind of frustrated about being stuck um, at a certain ranking for so long in their company and their business, and um, I proceeded to let them know exactly what I'm going to share with you guys. Um, number one, leadership doesn't start on the stages. It doesn't. Um, it doesn't start with the people that are on the stages, although those the, the, the people on the stages are amazing leaders. It does, but it does start in the pews at churches and in the back of the audience. Leadership starts at the bottom, at the bottom, and you work your way up and you earn the right to be on that stage. Now, um, I could tell you this, that if you're stuck at a rank, and I told my friend this, I said, listen, there's something you still need to learn at that rank position. That's why you're not moving forward. That's why that door is not opening. There is something you still have to learn, and I'm convinced of that. You see, um, you know, you will only move forward when you're ready to move forward. I believe this with my whole heart because as you move forward and as you step into your leadership, much more is required. Like the Bible says, those who have much, much is required. So you don't, you know, until you're ready to give a lot more, until you're ready to know what you need to know, sometimes you don't move forward. You don't move forward in your business. And uh, I would embrace that and think, what do I need to learn at the, at the spot that I'm at? What do I need to do better to move forward? And you will move forward in perfect time. Okay. So never give up. You know, the way I look at it is that I remember when my husband and I, we opened up our, um, our business that we opened a home and, you know, our construction company. And I remember our first year, we were just students. We were learning. We were at the, we were leaders, but we were at the, um, we were sitting in the back of the audience. <laughs> and uh, and in that first year, we made thirty five thousand dollars. We learned a lot, and we continued to grow. We continued to become students of that industry and grow in that industry. And I have to say, I'm so proud of where we come. And I mean, you know, ten years later, here we are um, as as business owners, as business owners doing, um, you know, a couple million dollars a year. And I. I don't say that and impress you, but I'd say that to impress upon you that it we didn't grow. It took us 10 years to get there, 10 years. And we grew as we we started investing in ourselves, investing in leadership, investing in learning, investing, investing in personal development. And the same goes with our network marketing business, you guys. When we first started network marketing seven and a half years ago, we were basically customers. I didn't even know what we were doing, but I knew that this industry was real and I knew that a lot of people had massive success in it and I wanted to be one of those people. But our first year in the business, it was, it was nothing. I think we made like 12 grand <laughs> and then uh, but I saw it and I decided uh, it, it, to, to become a student of the industry to become a student in this industry and my husband and I became great students and because of that we became millionaires in this industry as well so this is an industry in every you know like no other like no other but it does require you to step into your leadership it doesn't require you to invest in personal development so I'm gonna encourage you to grab that circle of five who are the circle of five that you're hanging out with um, Find a mentor. Who are you following? Follow the leaders. Do what they do. That's what we did. We decided to do what they do. We didn't decide to reinvent the wheel. We did what they did. We followed our system. And because of that, we became successful and you can too. Now, when it comes to leadership, you guys, you have to know that as you step up in leadership, you will also have more conflict. You'll have, you'll have to be able to take on more opposition. You'll have to be able to travel more, give more hours. So maybe maybe you're not step maybe you're not stepping into that because you're not ready for that. So when you become ready for that too, just know that that's part of the deal. Like when you are a CEO of your company, trust and believe, trust and believe as uh, you, they they get paid the more money because they have more to handle. <laughs> they have much more is required of them. So it's always possible. Never quit. Never give up. Follow the leader. Follow the person that you want to become like, and just embrace. Embrace where you're at. Know that as you grow in your leadership, the door will open and you will step through that door. And then you will step through the next door and the next door and the next door. As long as you're willing, as long as you're willing to invest in yourself, as long as you're willing to grow. So with that being said, you guys, I hope I've inspired you. Thanks so much for watching this video. Never quit your business. Just make sure that you're, you know, you've got that circle of five nice and tight and you're hanging out with people that love you, encourage you, motivate you. And most of all, they inspire you and they want you to be successful because at the end of the day, you guys, there's enough success in this industry and in every industry for everybody, for each and every one of us. So let's embrace each other. Let's lift each other up and uh, let's encourage each other to be our personal best. And until the next video you guys you make it a great day and we'll see you soon bye bye